the um, Sveavirkin F100H. Anyway, finally, I've got to go on it. The guys have been uh, using it and uh, I haven't had a chance to get on and have a go with it, but um, yeah, I'm pleased to say it works really, really nice. Effortless, actually. You don't really know it's even part of the tractor, if you know what I mean. It just, everything seems so seamless. Um, yeah, obviously on these ones, you don't have a steering wheel turning. Uh, doing the steering for you. Anyway, as well as uh, on these kits, uh, just steer away. Let's just steer back around. Anyway, Davo's been using it the most, I think. He said it was pretty good. Press the button. going to turn the, uh, the steering alarm up a little bit because I can't hear it but um, apart from that you wouldn't it's so smooth look at that you you wouldn't know the tractor steering itself is that smooth this one is a steer ready tractor so all we had to do was plug the screen to the tractor set the screen up for canvas steering the, uh, the screen's got one, one wire that goes directly to the tractor, one wire that goes to the battery, two wires that go to the uh, receiver. Yeah, it's that simple. So, yeah, what a lovely piece of kit this is. Uh, we're using PBP signal, but, you know, this tractor would never have been able to have RTK. But now, if we want RTK signals, uh, we can put a SIM card in there and we can have RTK signals. That will put you on the same wheelings every track. Uh, but we find PBP, for the most part, of what we're doing, we find it very good. Yeah, I'll have a bit of kit. Anyway, just a short update, just to show you it all working. What a bit of kit that is. And you, uh, yeah, you, like I said, you don't even, you can see the steering rams going down there. It's so smooth. I, I didn't think it'd be this smooth. I was worried it was going to be a bit, you know, jittery and jerky, but it's um it couldn't be more smoother oh man this is brilliant yeah anyway we're out tedding i'll show you the job look turning some meadow hay and uh it's nearly ready actually tomorrow we'll be baling it but uh yeah i wanted to show you guys this working in the field um, Davo's been out topping with it, he's done various other jobs with it and he said it was um, yeah, very good, so I'm so pleased. Anyway, yeah, if you've got a steer ready tractor and uh, you want to put a, a simple steering solution on there, make sure you have a word with Sphere Birkin. Uh, the guys are super helpful and they'll let you know how easy it is to get it going, but this couldn't have been easier. perfect yeah and wild shaft anyway they're, they're so much nicer to use these tractors with uh without the steering wheel but you know the steering wheels are, for me fine I, do, I don't mind it um it's the accuracy that's uh, the main you know the big win anyway farmer got it all installed there's uh, a few wires just here that go to the back of the screen but apart from that everything else has been nicely hidden away we've got a master switch down there that you do that you turn it on and uh, it works as as the old one did the tractor if you go above if you go so fast down the road it all knocks it off you use the pillar post these are your um your valve your uh, your on button for your valve but if you go so if you go above 30k in the on the road it turns all that off so you can't accidentally hit the button and you know, get steered away into traffic or whatever. I can't believe how good that is. Lovely. The one that was on it, we've kept it. All the brackets and everything can just be fitted back to it in 10, 15 minutes. We'll, be, we'll have that all back on if we ever sell the tractor. So it can go back. Yeah, I can't believe how simple that is to do. So I'm glad I got to show you in the field with it. There'll be uh, plenty of footage just using this all the time. We've got three of these kits now. We've got two, two, uh, 
steering wheel kits and we've got the uh, hydraulic kit now as well. I can't get over how smooth it is. It's lovely. This is the way to have it. Anyway, you know, the, the, the beauty is, if we had gone to Massey, they said, I think they did say that, you know, there are, there are look how smooth that is. You want it faster, you can adjust uh, in the parameters. You can just have everything run a little bit faster. But the beauty is, you'd never be able to run RTK with a Massey kit on here because it's all out of date now. But with this, you can go RTK and uh, for very, very little um, work, you, you can go RTK and it just brings the tractor real, back up to date and uh, it's really good, yeah. Anyway, they've all got a um, fire management system on there. We'll go into that another day. But um, yeah, if we wanted to share lines now, I could, uh, I'd have to connect it to my phone because there's no SIM card in there. But uh, I would simply, um, sync the data, the farmer could then come into this field, he'd have the exact same line on his tether, and uh, he could start from that side, we'll meet in the middle, and uh, it would have worked out brilliant. But there we go. Anyway, there'll be plenty, plenty more footage of this being working away. Uh, we're just, uh, yeah, I'm so happy with it. We were, when we was installing it, I'd come across a few issues, but they were actually non-issues, if you know what I mean. They were, they were uh, all down to me in the end, so yeah, there we go. As it turns out, it was a very, very simple thing to uh, add on here, and um, what a, yeah, just brilliant. Oh, man. Anyway, just a quick one there, really, just, seeing, uh, uh, just showing you all working in the uh, field. If you've got a steer-ready tractor, do your research and uh, have a look at this, definitely, because uh, that was just what a brilliant bit of kit that is. So, there we go. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. We'll catch you next time.